Okay, we are going to look at our 5C2. Uh, 5C2. <laughs> Okay, we're done with the gradient of OB. So next, we are going to look at our C2 here, which is the value of our, the value of our P here. So where is our P? If you look in our diagram, it's going to be at D here. So... How did we want to find the value of P? You already, okay, if you look at the question, we have uh, find already the gradient of line OB. Am I right? Am I right? And we know, okay, that our gradient OB is same with the gradient of CD. Am I right? Yes. Okay, so if you look over here, okay, we are going to use the gradient. Okay, we are going to use the gradient. How to use the gradient? Okay, now, our C here, if I want to make our coordinate, what should I get over here? X and also 0. Am I right? Why? Because it lies on our X axis. Am I right? Am I right? Okay. So we know already that if we are going to find our gradient, we are using the formula of Y2 minus Y1 over X2 minus X1. Am I right? Okay. So... If you look over here, I'm going to take this one as my x1, y1, x2, y2. So if you look over here, the gradient of CD, you are going to have y2, p, minus y1, 0, over x2, 8, minus x1 is x. Am I right? Am I right? Okay. So what you have over here, you already know the gradient of CD. Which one is your gradient of CD? Is equal to the gradient of OB, which is 5 over 5 over 3. So I just substitute over here. Alamak. Kenapa tak boleh? Ah, okay. 5 over 3 over here equals to P minus 0. P minus 0. P over 8 minus X. 8 minus X. Isn't it? Okay. What did you have over here? The value of P. Nampak tak? I don't know what... Oh, okay. Now, what we have uh, from the C1 just now? Okay. C1, previously, we find the gradient of our o, OB. We know that two lines over here, OB is parallel to CD. Am I right? So the gradient will be? C. Okay. So if we want to find the P here, the value of P here. So by using the gradient of C, D, we know already it's going to be the same with our OB, which is 5 over 3. Okay. This one, this one. How did I get 5 over 3? From the gradient of OB. Am I right? If you get right at the first answer, you said this one, you get right. Okay. 5 over 3 here. Okay. So how did we want to calculate? How did we want to find our gradient? We know by using the formula of y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. Right? Okay. So we are going to use CD here. That's why I'm going to get our C here. We didn't have the coordinate. Right? But I'm going to substitute this one x and 0. Why x and 0? We didn't know 
know it lies at our x-axis. Am I right? Am I right? And zero here why? Because our y-axis is zero. Why? That's what I get over here at zero. Correct? Correct? B already given A3, right? Done. So we know we are going to substitute in our formula y2 minus y1. So y2 is P minus y1 0. Nampak tak? Over x2 A minus with x1 here is x. That's why I put that 8 minus x. Okay? Okay. Yeah. So after I substitute here, 5 over 3 equals to P over 8 minus x. What the question asking you to find? P equals to 5. Did the question ask you to find your, 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 your coordinate C? No. no? Just stop at it there. Faham tak sekarang? Faham. Uh -huh. That's the answer. P equals to 5. Done. Jangan marah cikgu, bukan marah Penerangan So the answer here You are going to get P equals to 5 Because the question is asking For us to find the value of Of P Okay Yeah Oh ingat kau ada soalan Angkat punya oh, Rupanya mengeliat je Haa Okay, next, we are going to find the equation of straight line CD. Uh -huh. We know our gradient already. Okay, before we answer, the equation of straight line, why is that? Ah, y equals to mx plus c, isn't it? In equation of straight line, there are two things only you have to find out. Which is, the first one is going to be the value of our gradient. The second one will be the value for our y. Y intercept. Not the value of our coordinate. See there. <laughs> Can. Did we have our gradient? Kita ada gradient tak? Ada. Apa? 5 over 3 Isn't it? Yes. So What we are going to find now? We are going to find the value for our Y intercept Am I right? So by using uh, Our coordinate D We have already 8, 5 Am I right? So by substitute what? This is going to be X This is going to be Y so, I'm going to get y here is 5 equals to gradient here is 5 over 3. x here will be what? 8. And we are going to find our c. Cut. Why I'm using coordinate d? Kenapa saya nak pakai coordinate d? Kenapa saya tak pakai coordinate c? Because we have the value for x and y for d already. Can. Uh, so, 5 times 8. 40 over 3. Bring to the left. My. My minus. So, you are going to get over here 5 minus with 40 over 3. By using your calculator, you are going to get. Namanya Berapa? Negatif Eh, hey, kau kelihatan tu No, 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 no Change into uh, Fraction Thirty-five Not twenty-five Twenty-five, right? Uh. So you have the C value or the Y intercept So we are going to Substitute back into our Equation of straight line Y equals to What? 
5 over 3 x plus oh sorry minus with I will see here is 25 over 3 then ish 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 so what can you say for the questions over here is gonna related from the first one second one and the third one if you cannot find the gradient then you cannot find the value of p then you cannot find the equation of straight line cd here can okay next oh rah, 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 rah. what we have over here the diagram shows the combination of a cyclic quadrilateral PQRS. Ah, you're going to to have a cyclic quadrilateral PQRNS. Okay. Before we answer our question, what does it mean by cyclic? Girls? All our vertices is going to be at our circum circumference. And what can you say for the cyclic? Ah, you are going to have the opposite going to be 180 also, right? Ah, so the total is going to be 360 lah. Okay. Centered at O. O is going to be our origin there. Okay. Center origin pula dah Center Okay And try And a triangle PST Okay We have another one Which is a triangle here Aha uh -huh. What we have here PST What type of triangle we have Oh okay If we have PRT You are going to get What is that Isosceles Am I right uh, because this one uh, Because it say over there PT equals to PR uh, But the one We have a triangle PST only Okay Calculate the value of Y Okay Oh the question only that mm -hmm. First thing first You have 60 degree there. You have 70 degree there. What can you... Uh, which one you are going to find first? Yes. Angle R by using our... RPQ. Am I right? Ah, this one, remember back. What we have... Uh, With the same The same arc So this one is going to be Two times from the circum Circumference Did you remember? Ah, So we have over here PQ So if at our Center here is 60 degree Means that this one Is going to be half So 30 degree Okay Next What else we can have over here? Anyone? If I have my 60 degree, okay, we look at our POQ then. If our sen uh, I got the little triangle there, right? So what I have over here, I'm going to get this one also 60. Why did I get this one at 60? It, uh, uh, the question, the, dia tak cakap pun yang tu equilateral kan? But we know that if we have a triangle that are going to be 60 degree there, means that the remaining is going to be 180 minus, isn't it? 
Ah, uh, so the angle there is going to be the same. Why? Because you are get from the ra radius, same length, isn't it? Ah, uh. next. What else? Anyone? 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 Okay. Anyone? Huh. Tak tahu oh, Okay So If you look over there At our P Okay At our P here We have 70 degree We have Y And we have 60 degree Means what? Means the remaining there I'm gonna get 180 Minus with 70 plus with 60, what you get? Hey. 70 plus with 60, 150, right? Uh. Okay, so what you are going to have over there is going to be 30 degree. So where is 30 degree? Which one going to be 30 degree there? Hey. I wonder why. Total there lah. Means what you are going to have. Uh, look at the P ya. Eh. Tengok dekat P. Tengok dekat P. P. Kamu dah ada 70. Kamu dah ada 60. Betul tak? Ah, So over here you got another two more angle which is your Y. And also the other angle that we don't have over here. Isn't it? So both of the angle here I'm going to get 30 degree Why? Because 180 Minus 70 Minus 60 Am I right? One hundred eighty minus seventy minus sixty is going to be fifty. Yeah, 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 Okay, fifty. Sorry, 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 sorry. Okay. Okay, next. We know that y plus with the other angle is going to be fifty. So how did I want to find the other angle then? Okay, I'm going to say this is going to be x lah uh, over here. Oh, x plus the. Hmm. I cannot. How come divide the two? Hmm. Tolak tiga puluh. Fuf. Why tolak tiga puluh? Sebab tak tahu. <laughs> Janganlah macam tu kok. Ha. What else we have in our diagram here? What else? Come again. Opposite angle, which one? 100? Nak kena cari X ke? Tak payah kot Kan? Sekejap Why? Sekejap, sekejap, sekejap Okay, we are going to KIV this question first Next Alamak
Alamak For our question 6B Okay, the diagram shows a solid containing a right triangular prism with uniform cross section A, B, C Okay, sorry for the question here tak nampak eh Oh, ni ha Okay, ada, 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 ada. Apa dia? Oh, okay. That one we KIV first. Okay, the diagram, okay, is given to us here. A right prism, a prism with a trapezium CGML, and its uniform cross section above the horizontal plane. KLMN is a, an inclined plane. Okay, LC, L <coughs> to C. Okay, this one. It's given L to C here. 5 centimeter. BE, where is BE? BE, BE. Mana BE eh? Oh, ni belakang. Over here. Kan? Betul tak? BE is going to be 4 cm. Okay. The question. Draw a full scale. Elevate the solid on a vertical plane parallel to GH as seen from Y. Huh? Soalan dia yang tu je? Dia bagi X. Kenapa? Tu dalam diagram kan dia bagi X Ada X kan? Ya yeah. ha? ah, X dia bagi depan Tapi Y dia bagi tepi So the question here asking only from Y isn't it? Okay So we are going to draw this one Okay So our diagram Our diagram Our eyes is going to be at Y here Okay First thing first, if you look over here, what will you see? Yeah, we are going to see at the back there. At the back there, kenapa gambar raja? Gambar raja blur lah. Sekejap, saya tengok kertas soalan kejap. No, dia punya ni gambar raja dia tak berapa nampak lah. Dekat mana muka surat? Okay. Okay, kalau BE tu dia kata 4 cm, GH kita 2 cm, means what? Means, we are going to have at the back here is more than the front. Am I right? Yang ni, 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 kelas. Our A, F and BE here. Okay, you are going to have over here is... 4 cm and also this one is going to be the same like this one is going to be 2 cm. Agree? Okay? Then, if you look at the front, we are going to have another plane which is LKJC. Am I right? Yes. Yang ini, you akan nampak uh, CJ tu berapa? CJ. CJ going to be the same with GH. Am I right? So this one you are going to get 2 cm. Okay. Then you are going to see our D and H G here. Betul tak? Okay. Betul sahaja. Ah. So they are going to be three plate. Girls. Girls. First thing. At the back here. Okay? Okay. We know that from B to E, 4. Front here, if you look, 2. 
Maksudnya Depan tu Kecil Belakang tu akan nampak Nampak satu, uh, dua sentimeter dulu kat luar Faham tak? Boleh, boleh imagine tak? Maksudnya depan ni dua sentimeter Ni, this is two sentimeter And the back dia going to be Four sentimeter Which kamu akan nampak dua sentimeter Terlebih, faham tak? The green and the blue one The yellow one Girls The yellow one Is going to be higher than the green one The green one kita akan nampak 3 cm Means the, the yellow one dia akan ada 2 cm lebih ke atas Faham kan? Boleh, boleh, boleh imagine right? Okay First what I'm going to... Okay, one more Sorry This one 2 cm Can you see by your eyes? Kenapa? Sebab dia kat belakang tu pun, depan ni dah 5 Depan lagi tiga, so belakang ni tak nampak dia punya dua sentimeter ni kan? So it's going to be what? Yes, it's going to be Dash 9 Dash 9, betul tak? Unseen 9 tu Ah, itu yang ramai orang tak nampak Okay, 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 okay. tak apa, tak apa, tak apa, tak apa Okay, let's draw this one Okay, first thing first, what I'm going to draw here is going to be my 4 cm dulu. Ah. Okay, so saya ambil dulu B to E. 4 cm. 1 2 3 4. Okay, 4 cm from B to E. Next, we know that our yellow and the green one is going to be 2 cm, am I right? Okay, so means that this one, 1, 2, here. Ah. So this one, I'm going to draw our 5 cm for our CL. Nampak tak CL? The, 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 the ye yellow one Okay One, two, three, four Tak cukup lah pula Okay, mana boleh agak Kena betul ni oh, Five Agak-agak, agak-agak Okay, so I got this one Straight line Okay, five But Our uh, B to A is going to be what? Two centimeter Okay, 2 cm 1, 2 Sini Kenapa saya tanda macam tu? Sebab dia lagi saya nak buat dash line Faham tak? Okay And 3 cm Ah, 3 cm here Okay We are going to get 2 here First 2 First 3 And the other one is going to be LK okay. okay So Kalau awak tengok yang 2 cm here, sorry. Uh, this one saya akan buat juga 5 juga ini. Okay, this one also the yellow one ah. The yellow one straight away you are going to get Oops, kenapa panjang sangat pula? 5 kat sini. Ha, ah, okay. Okay. This one straight away you are got uh, you are going to look at solid. Yang ni. Yang ni yang kuning tu kelas. Boleh nampak tak? Boleh. Okay. The green one is going to be here also which is 3 cm. It's going to be solid line. Ya okay. ah this one the green one. The blue one saya akan dapat dekat sini which is uh, 4 cm Sekejap ya Faham tak ni saya punya lukisan ni ha. Yang ini yang kamu kata dash line Kenapa? Sebab yang ini yang tak nampak Lepas tu you akan nampak 2 cm dekat luar Yang ni akan jadi so Solid 2 cm So yang ini you akan nampak yang biru Terkeluar dekat luar ni eh. 
So, dia akan nampak yang ni lah. Itulah dia punya jawapan. Boleh faham tak? Can you see that one, girls? The green, eh, eh. The green and the yellow, dia akan nampak sama. Sebab apa? Sebab both are two centimeter at the bottom here. Kan? This two centimeter. So, green nampak here. Three centimeter. Yellow also nampak sampai lima centimeter kat atas tu. No problem. Okay. Okay. For the blue one, okay, the height is two centimeter. The length is going to be four. Means that the length here will be longer uh, daripada kita punya yellow, CJ and also deviation. Faham? So that's why dia lebih ni. Lebih berapa centimeter? Dia punya punya berapa ni? Kalau this one is two, this one is going to be two. two. Because the total here is four. four. The height here is going to be 2 Okay So this one dia akan jadi dash 9 Kenapa dash 9? Sebab this one is going to be unseen line Sebab dah ada the, the green and the The, the yellow one Dekat depan Tetapi disebabkan ni ada lebih dari 2 cm That one going to be solid line Boleh kelas? Boleh Lagi? Kena buat apa kelas? Label Okay So if you look over here First thing first I'm gonna see at the bottom here Ah, ni You akan nampak yang ni semua Apa tu? G C B Oh G C B macam burger lah pulak oh. G C B tiba-tiba lapor eh Oh Okay, then uh, Over here I'm going to see H and J In the middle here H, J Then ah, uh, Ujung ni tiba-tiba je apa ni Ah, uh, yes Oh, ini saya punya gambar tak nampak eh Ni, 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 ni. Kan? Betul tak? Ah, tapi tak apalah betul lah jawapan kita juga. <laughs> okay You akan nampak D and E. Kat mana D E? Dekat sini hujung ni. Ah. Okay After that up here. Ah, yang ni A saja. For the blue one. Ah, hujung ni yang akan nampak F saja. The green one yang akan nampak apa? M dengan N The yellow one you akan nampak L dengan K That's all Berapa markah? Empat markah je Okay We are going to look at our last question Okay this one The diagram shows a solid containing semicircle and two cuboids on a horizontal plane. The radius, ah, girls, is given the radius of the semicircle, ah, uh, semicylinder is one centimeter. Mana dia? So, apa yang awak dapat dekat sini? QR here. Kalau dia bagi radius is 1. So QR is what? Girls, saya tanya soalan. Radius 1. My question, how about QR? Radius tu daripada pusat ke ni Diameter is QR So QR is going to be 2 times 1 You are going to get 2 Faham? Ah, itu Dia tak bagi tahu awak lah kena tahu Ah, Okay The height of the semi cylinder is equal To the height of the cuboid ah, Mana? Oh, this one. 
Ini girls. Cuboid a uh, apa B C D E. Maksudnya berapa ni? Yes, 3 cm means I got over here from Q to apa ni eh? F ke E? F. Ah, uh, F over here also 3 cm. Faham tak? Faham. Oh, ah, good. Okay, this one is going to be the same. Okay, the question. Draw a full at full scale the elevation of the solid on the intersecting plane parallel to ABC as seen from X. So your eyes is going to be here. So what will you see, girls? Ah. You akan nampak akan nampak tak uh, apa silinder tu? Silinder tak nampak ya. Ha. Okey. Apa yang awak akan nampak? Ni. Ini akan jadi straight. Ha, oh sorry. Saya akan jadi macam ni. Kan? Second, you akan nampak yang ini. Saya lukis yang yang, yang belakang dulu eh. Ha. And third, you akan nampak yang ini. Itulah jawapan dia. <laughs> Itulah jawapan dia. You will get three uh, three quadrilateral. Ha, saya tak sebut. Sebab apa? Well, the blue one is going to be what? A square. Three times three. The green one, I'm going to get two Times with 5. Am I right? The yellow one? Ah, uh, This one bukan 2. Sorry eh. Yang ni akan dapat 1 eh. Uh, sebab this one is going to be radius kan? Ah, uh, 1 times with 3. Uh, lukis lah. 2 je lah. Macam 2 je. You. Okay. Take out our ruler. First thing first. Saya nampak apa dulu? Okay, the yellow one first. I'm going to draw 1 cm. Okay, 1 <coughs> cm here first. 1, done. Okay. Then the green one, I'm going to draw. Uh, MN. Okay, this one is going to be 2. Oh, eh. 1, 2. Done. The blue one, I'm going to get 3. 1, 2, 3, done. Okay. Then, what you are going to have is our height. Okay, the yellow, I'm going to get 3 cm, kan? Betul tak, kelas? Okay, the yellow, we are going to draw 3 cm. So, upright over here. 1, 2, 3. Done. This one, the green one, you are going to have 5 cm. Okay, because it's going to consist of 3 plus 2 here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Done. The blue one, I'm going to get 3 cm. Lepas ni waktu apa kelas? Okey, Puan Jun eh. Puan Jun datang sini ke? Siapa tempah? Tak tahulah kena tengok jadual uh, makmal. Saya pun tak tengok sebab jadual dia dekat depan bilik guru lah. Okey, there you go. Okey, first thing I'm going to get this one. Alamak, nampak sangat nipu ni. Okay, we are going to draw our square. This one naik sikit lagi 2 cm. And the yellow one, one centimeter. 
Okay. So, what we are going to do here, we are going to label. Okay, first thing first, what you are going to see here, I'm going to see T and A, F. Yang ni akan nampak B, E. Yang ni akan nampak C and D. Atas ni J saja. Yang ini akan nampak G dengan K. Atas ni akan nampak L with M. This one P with N. This one akan nampak Q dengan R kan? R dulu. R first then Q. This one is going to be as done for marks. Mana, mana? Oh, ya. Yeah. HJ, sorry. Done for our discussion.